Hello, my name is Dr. Todd Jackson, board certified ophthalmologist here in Las Vegas, Nevada. Today we're going to be talking about secondary cataract. A lot of patients ask me, Dr. Jackson, once you take care of my cataract, will I ever get a cataract again? The short answer is no, the an long answer is yes. Let me explain. We'll start once again with the anatomy of the eye. Cornea, sclera, optic nerve, sclera, optic nerve, thick cornea, iris, ciliary body, retina, iris, ciliary body, retina, and optic nerve, suspensory ligaments called zonules, and the intraocular lens. When this intraocular lens becomes opacified, it's called a primary cataract. <clears throat> cataract surgery is performed, making a hole in the anterior capsule. Many individuals ask, well, how does that artificial lens stay in place? And the way that the artificial lens stays in place is the capsule is left behind, which is a very um, thin substance. The posterior surface is approximately four to five microns. The anterior surface is about 10 microns. So this is called a capsule. Months to years, and sometimes never, some cells can proliferate on this back surface of this lens. In reality, it's not on the surface of the lens. It's actually these cells are growing on the scaffolding of the capsule, causing what's called a posterior capsular opacification. otherwise known as a secondary cataract. So, when you ask the question, can I get a cataract again? Yes, you can get what's called a secondary cataract. What are the symptoms? Kind of glare, halos, similar symptoms to what you had when you had a cataract. Now, the treatment of it. The treatment of a posterior capsular opacification is an ND YAG capsulotomy. Essentially, uh, a laser is used in the office to clean off and make a perforation in that membrane. So if this was the capsule, the intraocular lens being inside of the capsule with the haptics suspending it, the posterior surface of the capsule begins to have this opacification. A laser is used to make some micro perforations in that capsule and essentially open this back up. So light can then come into the eye unobstructed. The procedure takes approximately 30 seconds. There's no pain. A drop of preparacaine or other numbing agent is instilled into the eye. You go you are in a slit lamp similar to the one that you use in your normal doctor's office and uh, you'll see pops of light afterwards. Your vision will be dark for about 10 to 15 minutes. Other than that, you're good. You can go home that same day. You don't have to not eat before the procedure. It's very straightforward. And the good news is, is there's no such thing as a tertiary cataract. So once you do this one-time cleaning, it always stays open, or almost always. Thanks. Good to talk to you again.